Hello, and welcome to the Daily Almanac for December 8th. So, let's get started. First day in history! <laughs> On this day in history, December 8th, 1765, Eli Whitney was born. He was an inventor, a mechanical engineer, and a manufacturer who invented the cotton gin. The cotton gin is a machine that separates cotton fiber from the seeds. The device, patented in 1793, greatly helped expand cotton growing in the southern USA. Also, on this day in 1863, President Abraham Lincoln announced his Reconstruction Plan. It offered general amnesty to all white Southerners who took an oath of future loyalty to the Union and accepted wartime measures abolishing slavery. Whenever 10% of the number of the 1860 voters took the loyalty oath in any state, those loyal citizens could then establish a state government. And on this day in 1866, the first Trans-Pacific Sidewheeler steamship in the U.S. was launched in New York. It was named the Celestial Empire, with capacity for 1,300 passengers. The ship had a wooden hull and three masts. The boilers burned 45 tons of coal per day. Today on Word Power, we're going to talk about the word Venezuela. Venezuela is a country in South America. Although there are different stories about where the name comes from, many believe that it was created when Italian explorers came to South America. They saw that the native people of the area had built houses on stilts above the water. This reminded them of the Italian city of Venice, which is also built on water. The word Venezuela means Little Venice in Italian. <laughs> Today on Extremes, we ask, what is the fastest bird on land on the planet? The answer is the ostrich. Ostriches are also the largest birds in the world, but even though they're so massive, they can run up to 43 miles per hour or 70 kilometers per hour, and that's faster than a greyhound. Ostriches are perfectly designed to run quickly. They have long, powerful legs and only two toes. One of their strides can be 10 to 16 feet long or three to five meters. Health tips. When you look in the mirror, you always see just one side of your body, your front, but your back is just as important. So when you take a bath or a shower, don't forget to clean your back. One way to help is to use a special tool called a back scrubber. If you don't have one, you can use a washcloth that's long enough to hold between your two hands. You can also ask your mom or dad for help in reaching the hard to get places. I Do you have a lunchbox? Using a lunchbox for your food is a great way to be an Earth Alert hero. That way, you don't have to throw away your lunch bags every day. You can bring home your lunchbox after school, wash it out, and use it again the next day. You can find all sorts of cool lunchboxes with great designs. Hey, tell your friends that if they want to take care of the planet, they should use lunchboxes too. Well, that's all the time we have left today for Daily Almanac. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you tomorrow. <laughs>